So it's been a long three plus weeks struggling with this thing, building this Enraged Rabbit Carrot Feeder. Uh, initial plan was it was going to go over here with a rep rack underneath to hold spools and go up. Uh, behind it that didn't work because it's impossible to load the cotton buffer in that configuration so we went out this weekend and we built this table uh, not too bad uh, one two by four foot sheet of MDF three quarter and four two by fours and then around the back we got a rep rack mounted Spots for six spools with rollers, and that feeds up to the cottontail buffer. Um, we've just got two filaments loaded on there right now for testing. Uh, finally got the filament cutter to work. That thing been driving me crazy. Um, but we finally got it. A little bit of help from a guy on Discord. There's a drag chain binding against the drag chain holder, and... I just kept overlooking it, kept looking at everything else but that, and uh, that's why it pays to have a second set of eyes sometimes. But anyway, so we've got uh, tool one loaded right now. We'll show you what it looks like on clipper screen. You've got um, the happy hair for clipper screen. Gives you this little carrot symbol. And you go there, and that gives you all of your controls for. Enraged Rabbit Carrot Feeder. Go over here to load, and we're going to load tool three. And then comes over, cuts the filament, and then it's going to unload it, and it's going to buffer it back into the cotton tail back there. And we'll slide over, grab your next one, and push that all the way down to the extruder. And the extruder will pull it in. And you're good to go. Go over here, just show you that it is fully loaded. We'll extrude. there you go so we'll find something for a test print and test it out but really excited to have this going um, I can tell you having built a 2.4 a highly customized Trident an LDO V0.2 and then a self-sourced switch wire um, the Enraged Rabbit Carrot Feeder more difficult than all of them. Took longer than any one of them. In fact, I could have probably built all four of these again in the time that it took me to get this thing built and running. So, um, definitely one of the hardest builds so far. And uh, we're going to have some fun messing with it. Make some colored prints for the little ones. What do you want printed first? Um, a robot. A robot? All right. Say bye.